Hi, my name is Vasily Rishai. I'm representing Sarichul Alangkorn University Secondary School in the International Student Science Fair. I'm here to present my project for OS, a water usage monitoring ecosystem. You might be surprised to realize how much water you actually use daily. The answer to this question is around 270 liters or in other words, 45 gallons per day. Because of this reason, I want to establish a mindset about conserving water as a habit. I have created a tool to analyze the water consumption per day. This tool consists of a water sensor that comes in two variants, a non-invasive ultrasonic variant and an invasive high effect based variant. These sensors actively report to a central telemetry server written in PHP and hosts on NGINX open source on my GitHub. The telemetry server then stores the data collected from the sensor in an intermediate MySQL database server to create a dataset. A machine learning program then analyzes the dataset to create an, a prediction model every week. Every weekend, the dataset is dumped into an HADOOP HDFS to improve the predictive model. The invasive water sensor works by utilizing the Hall effect principle. A magnet is attached to a rotor shaft in a measuring pipe and when through it flows to the pipe, the magnet induces a pulse of current in the wire that can be detected using the microcontroller's interrupt vector. The non-invasive water sensor, however, works by sending a vibration through the water and measuring a deviation distance from the source. This distance can be used to calculate the flow rate of the fluid, and with integral, we can calculate the volume from flow rate and time. The sensor is attached to a custom-made flow OS control board based on the ESP8266 EX system on a ship. The only the sensor board that is closest to the wireless access point acts as a gateway and now connected to the internet. Other acts as a relay to connect to the gateway. The data storage server is currently running in three Docker containers on Ubuntu LTS 18.04.6. The first container contains an NGINX plus PHP application that has a data recording script installed on it to record the data coming from the sensor to our second container, a MySQL database container that stores the data coming from the PHP script in a data table for further analysis. By utilizing the search container, we can use the collected data over time to create a predictive model to predict the water consumption of the following day. So water grid can better adjust its production to match the demand for water. This way, water production can be more efficient. The application is built on React Native to be compatible with our mobile operating system. It has six components, the hourly water usage in the form of a bar chart, the utilization of water in different applications in the form of a pie chart, Calendar that shows the water usage in every day of the month. Notification engine that warns you when you are approaching the usage limit you set. There are also two gamification components and a award given to you when you achieve your usage goal. A leaderboard to compete for the lowest water consumption per household. This project aims to develop an ecosystem of water usage monitoring that is accessible to everyone. By using a non-invasive method, installation is very easy. The application is very user-friendly and we encourage everyday people to start conserving water.